All right, what I'm doing here is I'm testing this controller on a variety of cars. I just picked a couple right here and swapping out the, the network boards to find out which one that I like the best. The, uh, the one I like is actually the one it came with. Uh, very nice low-end response. Um, just a little bit. That's just great. This is with the traction control fully on. And then it goes all the way up. But I really like that low range right there. This is a small 18K motor I put in here, our minnow motor for our classic series. And I really like that mild low end. And then, of course, there's something like the sideways car here that also uh, could use some taming. And that's just at a crawl. That's, uh, that's with a baby king in here, but that is just at a nice crawl. I like that. And then, of course, pull on. So you can hear that that very low end there. Now, if I turn the traction control off, um, you can see it's a little bit more sensitive, a little bit. Doesn't have quite the low. So that traction control makes a difference. I really like that. That's nice. So that lets you know how easy it is. You can just, uh, just pop these boards out like this and stick in another one. And then you can just test. Of course, you're gonna wanna test on the entire track, you know, in every section of your track to get the get the right feel but it's a very interesting thing to do and it does make a difference with your traction control as well um, so work with the sensitivity and adjustment and I think you'll come up with a winning combination